नमस्कार माय डियर फ्रेंड्स टाइम हैज कम द पीपल वर वेटिंग फॉर ईडी ऑफिशियल्स दे हैव रीच्ड दिल्ली चीफ मिनिस्टर अरविंद केजरीवाल्स रेजिडेंस एंड दे हैव स्टार्टेड questioning in the meantime arvind kejriwal turns to supreme court as probe team shows up with warrant the team is inside the chief minister's residence with a search warrant hours after the delhi high court refused to grant protection from arrest to arvind kejriwal in the liquor police case a team from the enforcement directorate has reached the chief minister's residence and begun questioning him under the prevention of money laundering act sources said the team consists of 12 officials and they are inside the residence with a search warrant and the phones of mr kejriwal and his family have been confiscated delhi minister saurabh bhardwaj who also is the chief minister's residence said the way the police are inside and nobody is being allowed in it it seems like a raid is being conducted it seems they have planned to arrest arvind kejriwal Mr Kejriwal who is the national convener of the Aam Aadmi Party has now approached the Supreme Court for an urgent hearing the aap chief minister has skipped nine summons issued by the enforcement directorate in connection with the alleged liquor policy scheme on monday he also skipped his summons issued by the agency in a money laundering case linked to alleged irregularities in the daily jal board the edt means questioning the daily chief minister residence less than a week after brs leader k kavita was arrested in the liquor policy case after her arrest mr kejriwal was for the first time named as a conspirator in the case ever since the first summons was issued by enforcement directorate in october last year and he was asked to appear on november 2 there has been intense speculation that the delhi chief minister would be arrested by the agency former delhi deputy chief minister manish sisodia was arrested in connection with the case in february last year and aap rajya sabha mp sanjay singh was taken into custody in october earlier on thursday the delhi high court had declined to give protection from arrest to mr kejriwal in the liquor policy case but had asked the ed to file a reply to his petition listing the matter for the next hearing on april 22 a bench of justices suresh kumar kath and manoj jain said we have heard both sides and we are not inclined at this stage to grant protection the respondent ed is at liberty to file a reply enforcement directorate has reached delhi chief minister arvind kejriwal's residence and they are questioning him the team has now reached the residence of arvind kejriwal what is expected we don't know but viewers there at the kejriwal residence we'll keep the visuals on one side because this is an important story also at 7:30 i was going to bring you more details on this story why viewers because today the court has denied relief from arrest to arvind kejriwal and you can see the guards there and there's a negotiation going on between the ed team ed has issued viewers almost a dozen now summons to kejriwal and with the court stepping up to the plate and saying no way can we give you relief from arrest viewers anything could happen
Kejriwal could be arrested. Remember, three of his cabinet ministers are still in jail. One member of parliament of the Rajya Sabha in jail. None of them got relief. They've applied for bail time and again, but got no relief. We're going to go straight across to our reporter. Anshul, what's happening? Anshul, what's happening? Uh, so yes, a team of the uh, a team of enforcement directed along with security personnel from the Delhi Police and in fact senior officials of Delhi Police has reached the residence of Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal. Remember, this happened after the Delhi High Court today. And uh, what we have been told at this point in time that a team of senior officers from the enforcement directorate, along with DCP rank officers of Delhi Police, has reached at the residence of Delhi Chief Minister. They are still trying to go inside the residence, is what we have been told within the next few minutes. They have already, uh, come, uh, in fact, communicated with the uh, TM security staff, and they, they have told them that they have come here for uh, official purposes and they want to meet the Chief Minister, is what they have told. Uh, the security personal data present at this point in time. It remains. Well, earlier in the day, so earlier in the day, Anshul, just stay with me, bear with me, because this is a standoff. And this standoff, viewers, is not the first time we are seeing a standoff. Of course, we saw a standoff in Sandesh Kari. We've seen standoffs earlier also with regards to Kejriwal in the Enforcement Directorate team. We have seen standoffs when the Enforcement Directorate has knocked. He is Chief Minister, no doubt, but under the Indian law, no body is above law. Everybody has to abide by the laws of India. They have to undergo all types of questioning by the central government agencies. Supreme Court, not satisfied with this order, but I just want to quickly go across to Arunima. Arunima, a big jolt from the Delhi High Court earlier today and the ED wasting no time. The ED wasted yes, no time. Yes, and enforcement directorate is confirming that yes, their officials are at, at Arvind Kejriwal's doorstep. But just so that there is no confusion, because in the past there has always been, uh, you know, identity crisis, multiple agencies probing these cases. ED is confirming that yes, indeed, it is their officials who are there. Uh, the clarity that is being given by enforcement directorate at this stage is that after what happened at High Court, the investigating team, uh, uh, you know, had no legal bar on them from proceeding as per what the IO thought was best under the Prevention of Money Laundering Act, Section 50, notice has been given uh, in two cases. One is the liquor policy scam, where nine summons have gone to Kejriwal. Um, tenth summon is on its way, we are told, by the enforcement director. The Kejriwal refuses to appear again. There are other legal remedies that the ED is already looking at. But there's also a Delhi Jal Board case in which he was asked to appear on the 18th and he refused. What the uh, you know presence of Delhi police DCP rank officers there also means is that the ED um, is apprehending there could be some kind of a law and order issue. We have seen be it the arrest of Heman Thorin or be it the presence of ED officials at Sandesh Khari or in Tamil Nadu. They have had to rely on central forces for the protection of ED officials. Uh, in this case also we are waiting for ED to officially tell us why are they there, under what case they are, they are serving, uh, you know, that their summons are proceeding against Arvind Kejriwal. But they are moving very swiftly and underlining that there is no legal bar on the I.O. And that's why these actions are being taken. Well, you never know. Viewers, we start. As per the latest news, already E.D. has entered his chief minister's residence and he is under questioning. Thank you for watching this video. Namaskar, my dear friends. Thank you. That another summons has been served today, the 10th in the liquor gate scan. The alleged, let me be very clear here, because all these parties have become extremely litigious viewers. You put a word, edgeway here, wrong foot there, that's it.